say you until the Lions go to Australia. And over the next couple of weeks, I'll be talking to loads of Aussie legends, but Lions legends as well. Stay tuned. Well, everybody talks about how the players come together. How do they become the Lions? What not a lot of people talk about is how fans come together. And there's English accents, Irish accents, Scottish accents, and everybody puts their own nationality to one side and you all jump on the Lions bandwagon. Well, I'm an England supporter, and he's a Scottish supporter. <laughs> well, he's like a part of a big family, really. The unique thing about the Lions is being adversaries one week and teammates the next. You just knit together straight away and you just know already you've made history being part of such a rare team. Where else can you go on holiday I'd be guaranteed you make friends for life. And the people we've met on that tour... We've been away with... We've been away with six or seven times... Since. Since. Great friendships, great rugby, great competition. And of course, there's the Anzac test. Australia and New Zealand come together to go against the Lions. <gasps> As a player, having the support of 70, 80, 100,000 Lions fans. It gives us an extra arm and a leg. There's actually a relationship between the players and you as supporters. I mean, we're on tour, but they're on tour with you. Everywhere we go, they, they go with you. Everybody joining together, singing together, celebrating together. The ex-Lions talking to you and t telling you about the game and their experiences. Touring with Lions Rugby Travel will give fans that opportunity. Drinking, chatting with former legends of the game gives you an extra dimension of fan experience that, that you won't get if you're travelling alone. <laughs>